Good morning. I'm Mark at Waddell's Garden Center, and we're going to be talking about raised beds. With a raised bed, you can do a lot with what we call square foot gardening. In square foot gardening with tomato plants, you're looking at one plant per square foot. If you do any more than that, they're going to crowd themselves. You're going to have disease issues that we do not want to have. The pest control. Pest and critter control, raised beds make it much easier to control those things especially with rabbits, you're gonna have this raised area here. The rabbits cannot jump over, will not get into that raised bed whatsoever. Pest control. A lot of the pests travel through the ground. Some may fly in, but it's very easy. It's up here. You can look at the leaves of the plant. You can tell when the critter's on there. Either remove them if you're into naturals. You can remove them by hand, put them in soap and water, or you can actually spray. We have some good sprays here, whether it's organic, natural, or chemical, depending on what your wish is, that will help control any pests. A lot easier to control. Portability. Uh, this raised bed here has cement fiber sides to it. It can be dismantled and put somewhere else. So you can move it from year to year, or just put it in one spot for a while, and then if you grow tired of it in that area, easily broken down and reassembled in another location. Obviously, more sun means more fruit. More sun means more tomato and so on and so on. Less sun, you'll still can grow plants, you just won't get as much fruit. This particular bed has a 30 year guarantee on its size. It will not fall apart, it will not degrade, it will not decompose on you whatsoever at all. You want to make sure though with any raised bed for that critter control that I talked about earlier, you want to put a hardware cloth. So that's a quarter inch mesh underneath so that moles, voles, do not get up and under and start undermining the root systems of the plants. Very important that you do that. Very easy to do. This is a four by eight bed. You can get hardware cloth in two feet, three feet. You can overlap them and they will prevent any small critters from coming up through. Other than the critters, the small critters that we have, we also have deer. And if you live anywhere in the Portage Kalamazoo area, you're gonna have a lot of deer. There are several ways to take care of that issue. If you're dealing with vegetables or, per, or plants, flowering plants, these are predator urine bags, crystal forms of coyote urine, that when you open the bag up, there's just one little bag in there, and you could suspend it from the side of the uh, raised bed, and that will emit oh no, an odor that, think, that makes the deer think that there are predators in the area, and they will avoid that area.